Welcome to a video from the digitallifestyle.com. In this video, we're going to look at the new build of Windows 10. This is build 19587 for Windows Insiders on the Fast Ring. So I've got it installed down here. And um, this build is pretty light on features. There's only a few changes that uh, I can tell you about and I can show you. So one change that they've done in this build is when you um, mute your device uh, through there, I've got my two speakers, it won't unmute if you press the volume keys on the keyboard. So maybe you're unmuted and you accidentally press the volume key. Um, it will, rather than just putting the audio back on, it won't uh, unmute until you manually unmute it using the hardware key or using the, the unmute down here. So I guess that's for, so if you, you you accidentally um, you, you accidentally press the volume up or whatever and it unmutes your speakers and blasts out then you know, you're not going to get that now so that's one change they also made a couple of improvements to narrator and uh, it's more um, it's more friendly now because the, it reads out some of the text better so the rest of the changes in this build are really all fixes so they fixed an issue with defender and the icon transparent background and they fixed the new, uh, an issue that uh, the um, default apps page in settings would crash when you try to change the default. So if you went in to default apps, let's do the through the uh, search. So when you went through any of these, say like that, it could crash, and they they fixed that. Uh, they fixed uh, an issue where some files couldn't be opened with Win32 apps and File Explorer went on very long paths, and they fixed some thumbnails. Um, inside a folder, a work folder, and they fixed an issue with uh, the session column in Task Manager, Would um, you couldn't expand it. Incidentally on this build as well, they, um, they're they blocking our build from ARM devices, so if you've got an ARM device you won't see that, there's not that many people running Windows inside builds on ARM devices, but you won't get that because of a, a bug check, that so Max could block that for you so you don't get uh, a crash. They've done some of the things. There's some other unknown issues, but BattleEye anti-cheat software, and Narrator, and NVDA. These are all favourites. Um, they um, green screen of death you may get during the reboot phase uh, when you're installing this build. If you get that, set it, set it, let it go to a scheduled time, and then it'll work. I did get that on one of my machines, so uh, that's still there. This machine that I'm running on now, the Surface Go, I didn't have that problem. They've uh, there's still some issues with the uh, privacy icon uh, in documents section. Uh, Windows print screen for um, doesn't work still for capturing screens and uh, DISM the repair tool corruption repair tool will stop at eighty four percent. They're looking at issues with that as well and sticky notes can't be moved around as well. So those are all the issues. There's not a huge amount to see with this build. This um, is a future build so this is not the april update that that's in slow ring this is a build that will be coming out at some point in the future in fact it might it's not even tied to a build anymore these are features that will come at some point in the future so thanks for watching this one you, you can see all our videos on our youtube channel right back to the very first previews of windows 10 including we've got new windows 10x videos as well so thanks for watching